about one in 10 children who become infected will die from an incocal disease even in 2023. I just don't think that's good enough. My role is really um, providing um, advice and generating evidence that's important to understand how we can stop this deadly disease and a lot of that is around immunisation. Evidence is so powerful. I mean, we can all advocate for something we want to happen and the answer can be no. I just find if you bring the evidence and you bring high quality evidence that is indisputable and you advocate for that change to health ministers, to government, to whoever, policy makers, it's really difficult for them to say no. So I knew the, U the UK just introduced a meningococcal B vaccine for infants. So I flew to the UK, uh, heard about the high effectiveness of the vaccine in their program, then uh, met with public health colleagues in the UK and also GSK, the manufacturer of the meningococcal B vaccine, to really advocate for South Australia to be the best place in the world to do a study to look at how effective it was in adolescence, but also to see if you could reduce young people carrying the bacteria and reduce them transmitting it to others. So after we finished the study, the health minister decided to introduce the meningococcal B vaccine for infants and for adolescents in South Australia. So we're the first place in the world where we had a program to protect both infants and adolescents against meningococcal B disease. Unfortunately, in many countries, meningococcal disease is still a problem. And I'm part of a meningitis global initiative to try and really reduce deaths from meningococcal disease around the world. I think my work will be done when we have adequate protection for children to stop them dying and becoming disabled from life-threatening infections such as meningococcal disease. It's fantastic fun working as a doctor with kids, making kids better. But if you can make changes at a population level and improve the health of the whole population, you know, how exciting is that?